we're so authentic that we drink Macca's coffee and we shake pancakes. No, <laughs> I can make pancakes. Where's the barista? Where's the... Where's the handmade? No, you can, but do we? No. We can no. make barista coffee, but do we? <laughs> no, I can't make barista coffee. Can you? You can't. I can learn. I'll, I'll do it. <laughs> do you trust me to? The barista is at Macca's. A minimum wage barista who... Minimum wage is better here than it is in America. That's true. Ooh, it's Ooh not sorry. <laughs> sorry. If you're thinking of moving to Australia, I'd just let you know. <laughs> um, so, how do you feel, Mrs. Jazza, about yesterday? Tired. Yeah. You're tired. I'm tired. That was one of both of our bigger work days in a very long time. Sorry if I haven't got to emails, I'm about to start doing them today. Pass any on that need to be passed on to this guy. And answer any I can answer myself so I'm about to do that Check today. Check out that awesome pancake in the meantime. <laughs> it doesn't look that awesome. <laughs> it tastes good though. <laughs> Pancakes with Jazza. Oh yeah. We don't normally talk about him in the third person. Yes we do. I do. <laughs> but which Jazza time? says good morning. Jazza would like to see his son. If anyone hasn't seen, if anyone hasn't seen that Dennis Quaid, <laughs> that Dennis Quaid Dennis video, Quaid is here. it's one of my favourite internet. Well, it's actually was on Ellen. It's one of my favourite things. Dennis Quaid in Starbucks I'll, I'll or link something. In the description, you need to watch. Someone it. wrote in the comments yesterday. If I had money for every time Jazza said he'll leak something in the description and didn't. I'm, I'm getting better at it. <laughs> well, apparently last night you missed Matt's website. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Don't you scare hey, me, mini I Jazza. I <laughs> <laughs> missed Matt's website because I wrapped up at like 3 a.m. So. <laughs> Alright, alright, we forgive you. I'm about to record an update video for my uh, main YouTube channel because <laughs> I'm not able to do any other content until this animation comes out. So it's a bit of an apology, but also a bit of a, a slight preview, a little bit of a plug, and just updates on other stuff in general. Uh, but yeah, this, this Telltale animation is dominating everything, but I'm really, really hoping you guys love it because it's taken up the majority of the last year of my life and Greg's life. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna get recording. Mini Jazz is playing with the mural while we approve the update video. And I really hope that you all enjoy the uh, the stuff. I'm in the sound studio and uh, my next task is to go through all these takes that I was sent by Matthew, my violinist. Apologies for not plugging him yesterday. I said I, I would uh, put a link in the description and at three in the morning, of course, I forgot. So I'm going to try and do that again this time. So if you want to check out his stuff, he has some very interesting violin stuff. But what I'm doing here is taking his six takes and listening to them section by section, uh, each in a row and picking my favourite one keeping it and then moving on to the next section and uh, the choices I'm making are sort of based on what sounds best with the rest of the instruments what is the best performance also how they flow into each other but uh, they sound awesome once upon a time in the quiet of the night in a city ages old in a street with little light I'm done for the day at 6 p.m. I am really happy with how this has come along. It's The music is like 98% there. Aside from mixing, uh, I want to throw in some flutes, but I've done all the violin, I've added other woodwinds, and I've sort of tweaked things up a bit, and I'm loving it. Now, I have to show you this, of course, because it looks incredibly fancy. Uh, all these yellow things are the violin, so all those uh, takes that the violinist did, this is that all chopped up with all the exact bits I want, uh, sort of balanced in a way that sounds good to me. Uh, then, aside from all that yellow, there are these lines here, which are things like harp and then piano here and there. And then we have the strings. So these are all just the orchestral strings layers and then with some individual things like cellos and some plucking and things. Then we have brass, uh, all laid into the big brass things, then trumpet and French horn. I love the French horn. Uh, and then we have some woodwinds. I'm gonna add a couple more of those, but otherwise I'm pretty happy with that. And then percussion. Here's a bit of a sample for you. So 
so Mini Jazza and I are gonna go shopping. We're gonna go get stuff for what we call easy roast, which is a roast chicken already cooked and easy roast potatoes and some other veggies. And that's my wife's favorite meal who's been slaving away on tax stuff, which is the most miserable thing I can think of. So I've had a really fun, cool day doing all this intense music. Even though it's been a lot of work, it's been really enjoyable. But uh, yeah, I can't, I don't envy. I don't envy doing tax all day, which has been doing second day in a row now. So I'm gonna try and cheer her up with some chicken and roast vegetables. Oh yeah. Mini Jazz is helping by picking chocolate for mummy. One of those and three. It's called easy roast because we don't have to do any work because we use a bag of frozen potatoes and an already cooked roast chicken. Yeah. It doesn't have the elegance of a home cooked roast, but when you're up all night doing taxes, who cares? I'm chopping up some veggies, and many jazz is helping with all the pots and pans. But you need another one. That's a very nice pile, but can we have a new pile? Where are you going to put it? There? Okay. He likes making piles. Oh, where are you going to put that one? There, yeah, good one. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> pop back into the sound studio momentarily. I'm just rendering the audio to send to the sound engineer. Uh, so first as one piece and then in layers and, and he'll start the mixing hopefully over the weekend. Uh, but in the meantime, it's time for the question of the day. Junko Triple X says, can we purchase the sheet music by itself? Yes, I intend to release two new products. One will be the Tale Teller development pack, which will be, I think maybe around 20 bucks which you'll have all the video footage of all the development and blah 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 but there will be another product which I think I'll make like $2.99 or something which will have the full orchestra song the sheet music the piano version of the song a few other bits and bobs but just music related because I know there might be some people just interested in that I'm also thinking of bundling the development pack with the animation foundation uh, video course. I don't know, let me know your thoughts on that if you think that is worthwhile. Anyways, that'll do for now. Uh, also, thank you to everyone for giving me your um, analysis on my personality based on the last vlog. They thoroughly entertained me. Uh, alrighty, cool. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. Man, I need a shave. You'll see a clean-faced jazzer tomorrow. Mark my words.